Good morning everyone, back once again with Jeremy. So today, as I do every day, well, that's not true, I don't do this every day, I don't get to sit out here and enjoy the weather, and normally I'm in my house kind of rushing around, maybe at a break time at work, but I was sitting out here writing today. Um, I do write my goals every day, as I've told you guys before, but I've been writing since the whole incident on my birthday a couple weeks ago, I've been writing every day, kind of starting a book, a memoir, or whatever you want to call it. And while I've been writing this today, I've, I've started thinking, well, I'm always thinking, as you guys know, but I've been contemplating, I guess, that how much, how much have I really changed in these years? It's an ongoing, <clears throat> excuse me, my allergies are bugging me a little bit. It's an ongoing process for me. As you guys know, I have pretty low self-esteem. And it's something that I have to consciously keep thinking about. And while I'm writing this book and reading over it and stuff, because that it will be edited, but as I'm doing this, I keep thinking, well, who wants to hear this? And I, I truly have to think, is this a bunch of lies that I'm telling to people? Is this really what's happened in my life? Is this really who I am? And this is tough for me. And I have to just keep going back and saying, you know, I am worth this. And some of the topics I talk with you guys are not easy. It's not easy to come out and say, I'm a liar and I've lied for a lot of my life. And to come clean and tell people, you know, the truth. Because there's a lot of times that the truth is not easy but for me and for what I want I have to I have to come out and I have to say but whatever it is whatever the lie was I have to come out and say it now there is a caveat to this and I've told you guys this before if you are like me or have been like me if you going to the person and making it right is going to cause more harm to them than it is good, then I don't believe that you should, in most instances, I don't believe that you should. I don't believe that you should do that. If it's not continuing to hurt them, then I don't believe that you should. Maybe I'm wrong on that, but that's, that's what I believe. So anyways, so today it's been a process for me. I, I've had to keep thinking, you know, I am worth I am worth this. I am worth working on. I do have a valuable message for you guys. And so, as you guys go throughout your day and as you work on yourselves and as you process and as you study and you step forward and you have these things of gratitude that we talk about, and as you do this, you need to remember that, you know what, even if you feel that no one is out, else is out there for you, I am. I'm here for every one of you guys. I'm here to support you. I'm here to do everything I can for you. Because at the end of the day, like I always say, you are worth absolutely everything you're willing to work for. Yes, work for. I know there's a lot of people who don't want to hear that. They want to win the lottery. They want to just have it on easy street. But I can tell you from experience that just having it on quote on easy street is not where you want to be. It doesn't make you happy. Yeah, it might make you happy for a minute. It might make you happy for a day, a week, maybe even a month. But it goes away. I mean, how many times do you see these billionaire kids and billionaire kids and millionaire kids and people that have made it and have the money um, that you see that they're in rehab and that they're in jail and things of this nature it happens a lot because it's not the money that gets you there it's the fulfillment it's the helping other people so that's what I need you guys to understand as you're working on yourselves you need to be looking for others to help I appreciate you guys I love you guys let me know if I can do something for you make sure you subscribe hit that like button let your friends know if there's anything I can do for you let me know I love you guys and I'll talk to you tomorrow